look naked. I'm not, I promise, semi-top, but I'm not naked. Just letting you know. But I think y'all already know it's about to happen. I'm about to give you some Rihanna shoulder, okay? The new Fenty stuff came out. I finally got mine in the mail. I actually went to the store on Friday and picked up the whole collection. But the darker bronze color was an online exclusive. So I had to order that one. And I was gonna just show you guys what I already had, but I figured I would, number one, I'd wait until I got the bronze. Listen, I was not feeling well all weekend. I'm just now playing catch up and it's Wednesday. So I know I'd miss the rush. I love body stuff. Y'all know I love body stuff. I've talked about the different types of body shimmers and things that I use in the summertime. This one is probably the most pricey one that I will be trying. Nope, that's not true because my Tom Ford, my Tom Ford glitter is $100, so. I, I'm not gonna do any comparisons because I wanna just focus on this product, but I'll probably do like a comparison of all of my different body oils and shimmers and stuff. If you guys wanna see that, I got you because I know summertime's coming up and you probably wanna know what's the best, right? We're gonna see if this was worth my money. I did buy everything. I bought the two colors and I bought the fairy bomb thing and the kabuki brush as well. Like I said, there's two different colors. The one that's available at Sephora in stores is called Who Needs Clothes? And this is, first of all, <laughs> the packaging is beautiful. Like, look at this. Isn't that pretty? It's really, really pretty. Um, it's very different from the other Fenty packaging. Like the makeup has like a graffiti-ish look to it. This one is like very, I don't even know what this is, but this is called the Body Lava, okay? It's three ounces, so you can travel with this. I was a little worried because this is kind of big, so I was thinking, <laughs> that's what she said. So it says, shake before use, silky, sublime, shimmer, dewy, ultra lit finish. This one is more of like a universal shade, um, so it works for both light and dark skin tones. I mean, honestly, the bronze one probably does too, but this one is not bronzing. It'll just give you a nice sheen. I tried it on in the store. It's really, really pretty. Sometimes you just want the glow and you don't need the bronze. I think that this is great that you came out with two colors instead of just having one. This one is brown sugar. So yeah, this is, woo! Ooh, ooh! This one is brown sugar and it, I'ma look like a Cinnabon. Wow. These are the two next to each other. So I really love the rose gold packaging and it actually is like hefty, you know, so it's not plastic. This is glass. So you gotta be careful with these. Just want y'all to see one more time how beautiful that is. Woo! I have my receipt. I paid for this with my money. Rihanna. I need a refund check for all of the Fenty stuff that I buy because the body lava is $59 or dollars, as Mama Jackie says. It's a little steep, especially if you bought both. This is the Rose on Ice Fairy Bomb. It's a glittering pom-pom and it says plus shimmer packed puff. And this one was $42. It's cute, rose gold. This is the puff. How do you get her out? All right, I'm gonna get back to that in a second. Uh, last thing I got was the Kabuki brush. Kabuki brush, $34. It's just a pink slanted, oh, this is cute. Shiny. Of course it's really soft. All of her brushes are actually really soft. We're gonna go ahead and try it. And I'm gonna get out your hair, cause I know that's what you're here for. I'm gonna try Who Needs Clothes on one side of my body, and then on the other side, I'm gonna try brown sugar. This is how I saw Rihanna do it. <laughs> wow, I wish my nail was done. I'm gonna use my middle nail so that this. She's ready. Are you ready for this? Yes. Oh, well, that smells really nice. It smells nice. It smells like perfume. Wait, wait. wait a minute. I'm gonna get some more. Bring it around town, why don't you? We're just gonna get, I don't have any 
Cleveland's, so it's not gonna really do anything to the chest, but we're still gonna be up here on the, cause I got a strong collarbone. So we're gonna, oh yes. And that's one thing I like about my other one, my Tom Ford glow block stuff. It's cause it smells like Tom Ford. So obviously, you know, you're paying for the smell. Um, and I would think that if I'm paying for this, I'm not just paying for the shimmer, I'm paying for the perfume scent as well. You know, this is not for just the beach, you know what I'm saying? Like if you're going to like a fancy event or something and your decollete is gonna be out. If anything, the smell is selling me on its own. Like it smells really good. Like this, I would wanna bottle up this smell and make it a perfume. Okay, uh, glaze honey bun. Tell hostess to get at me. That is who needs clothes and who needs clothes? Not me, okay? And what I like about this is that because this one is not bronze, doesn't have any color in it, just it's just the shimmer, it's not gonna mess your clothes up. We're gonna try the fairy bomb on top. I'm gonna try to get this out because I was struggling before. I probably wouldn't use this a lot, knowing me and myself, but because it's really not a lot coming out and I'm not sure if it's just me or what. I don't know. It smells good too though. So I'm just gonna try to, did that do anything? So I'm having difficulties with my, my fairy bomb thing. So I don't know, sis, I don't know. Maybe I'm not doing it right. She might be going back to Sephora. So this one is brown sugar. We're gonna do her on the other side. I want some of y'all brown sugar. Oh yes, I can tell. I can tell the difference. Oh yes. I can definitely tell the difference. So you got Cinnabon glaze realness over here and you got honey bun glaze over here. Ooh, wow. It's such a distinct difference, yet they're both gorgeous. I don't know which one I like better. I actually almost a little part of me likes who needs clothes a little a little tiny bit better only because no wait because the brown sugar is giving me tan though this is giving me like vacation like tan like oh I, my melanin is popping right but this one is like giving me sexy sweat <laughs> it's like if you are glistening because women don't sweat they glisten real like shower scene sex on the beach sex in the shower but whatever you do just know someone is coming for you honey because so obviously both of these are amazing but i would say if you can get your hands on this try to i would not take either one of these back and i'm really i'm really going to be ashamed of myself when i'm trying to take both of these on vacation with me 59 dollars is a lot but this is going to last a very long time it looks like it will because it's it's, it's a lot of product um, and you typically don't need a lot unless you're using it all over your whole body every single day But I don't live in the type of place to do that. So I'm not gonna run out um, I don't know about this fairy bomb thing though. Y'all I really am sad about it Like I wanted it to work for me, but I honestly don't I, I couldn't get it to work um, Maybe I'm tripping. Maybe I got a bad one. I don't know. The kabuki brush is nice Would I recommend it? I would if you don't like to get your hands dirty. I don't I honestly don't mind using my hands to do stuff. I don't I don't feel like I necessarily need the kabuki brush in my life, but it's something to have. You it's not like you wouldn't use it. You would definitely use it. Um I probably will be taking this one back because she didn't work for me. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. I will talk to you guys in my next one. Love you.